Hello collective, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for all of your likes, your comments, your shares, and subscribes. I truly appreciate them all, you guys. Thank you guys so much for all of your awesomeness, okay? You guys have been so supportive, so amazing, okay? Thank you for following all of my platforms. You guys are amazing. Okay, you guys. So, as I was coming into this energy, um, and I sat down here at my desk, uh, I got greeted with a song from, uh, I don't think that's Tony, 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 I'm not really sure, but Anniversary. Like, they was like, do you know what today is? It's our anniversary. It is? I was like, what anniversary, Spirit? What? Do <laughs> so I'm like, what? It is? So if y'all are celebrating an anniversary, congratulations. But apparently, it's our anniversary, y'all. <laughs> All right, and we're going to see what anniversary is this, okay? Because I didn't, that did, I didn't bring a gift. Did I... I didn't bring a gift. No, I'm sorry. I didn't know. I didn't get the gift. Oh, so they said you are the gift. Okay. So it's your anniversary, Collective. I don't know if this is the first day of some sort of awakening you had. First day of your spiritual growth. First day of something. But something happened today and they want you to know. Do, okay, wow, journey. Maybe this is the first day you got on your journey here after being in some sort of low vibrational energy. Maybe your first day of your healing process. All right. Oh, is. Let's see here, collective. <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, this could have been the first day you getting on this pathway to sudden wealth. Okay. <laughs> Look, I don't know, but it's your anniversary and you're on the path to sudden wealth. All right. All of a sudden. All right. So mark this date on your calendar. So next year you'll be like, oh my God, it's my anniversary. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> Let's see here. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. What is the overall energy for this reading today? Ah, Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. I mean, I woke up feeling super happy today, so I knew it was something going on. I didn't know what it was, though. You know, our soul be knowing, though. <laughs> What's going on here, Spirit? What's the message here for the collective overall energy for this beautiful reading? So we got the mature woman. All right. This you. All right. Yeah. Okay. So uh, they got some unex a gift for you. Unexpected income. All right. Yes. Official person. So mature woman expects some unexpected income from a mature person here. Okay. Official person. I'm sorry. <laughs> you could be the official person that's getting some unexpected income. Mature woman. Oh my goodness. Okay. Like what's happening. All right. The income could be an extra gift. All right. That's going to make you an official person. It could actually be some monties, okay? Maybe this is the first day you went from rags to riches. Honey, I don't know how deep this is going to go for the collected. But it's your anniversary here. Oh, my God. Yeah, time's up. It's your wish granted. So you could have been waiting for this wish to come through here to heal. All right, from somebody that has been overdoing a manipulation here. Somebody about to see things your way here because you can ready to go for it, take a new direction. And because the guy said that was it. It was up. Time's up. It's time for you to have your wishes fulfilled. Okay, yeah. So you could have been waiting for this. So what's about to happen? I'm excited. You guys, I'm excited. So whatever is about to happen is about to be like so flipping awesome. Okay. I mean, so flipping awesome. All right. <laughs> All right. Well, gosh darn it. Do you know what today is? It's your anniversary. <laughs> yes. Okay. Here and now. Something has been laid to rest right now. What's the flag say here? It says you are here at the doorway. You're about to go beyond all previous setbacks. If there was any setbacks in your life, you are already here. You made it to the doorway, the gateway. All right. It's time for a nap. So something 
is literally being laid to rest here. Your ancestors are looking over you here. There's going to be some healing also to your solar plexus or your sacral chakra as well. So do you, yeah, they watching you here. Yeah, so they watching you here as you go through. And remember, this was the moon here. Time for a nap energy. Wow, and the face is still there. And they watching. All right, it's here and now. So something is happening right before now. Okay, wow. So get creative here. This is something that's beyond your wildest dreams here. Whatever this is, it's like you never imagined that this was going to come here. So breathe, okay. <sighs> breathe out, okay. Breathe out. What is going on here? What is this? Okay, all right. I'm going to the light on here because this is getting serious, okay? Yeah, this is serious, okay? Yes. Let's see, you guys. Oh, the front door. Happy, happy. Okay, higher power. They like, go ahead, get happy. Oh, my gosh. Treasure Island. It's time to go towards Treasure Island, Lord. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I'm really excited, you guys. It's time to go. No, to no place like home. Oh, my gosh. So you guys could have made it somewhere here. <gasps> Look at milk and honey. Oh my gosh. Look at the way the cards are splitting. All right. Here and now, you're getting some sort of blessing here. TikTok, you could have been waiting for this. You have some deep knowing that this was going to happen. Milk and honey here. Okay. You just probably been going with the flow. All right. Or something like, you know what? All right. However, this is going to happen. However, this is going down. I'm ready for it in whatever way, shape, or fashion this is, okay? But this got something to do with the gates opening for you here. You're going to be so happy. Oh, my gosh. Like, why me and her hair the same way right now? Literally, my hair is like this. <laughs> oh, my gosh. No way. So, you guys, listen. Whatever this is. <laughs> You are definitely um, being gifted something from the universe here. All right. My beautiful star seeds here. My earth angels. It's like, get happy. Wish granted. All right. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Maybe you needed to make a decision here on how you was going to see something. Um, today, you could have got some really, I had got a deep epiphany today as well. So, you guys could have got some deep epiphanies. Like, oh my gosh, like, I can't believe all this time. Like, I literally had got one of those today, you guys. And if you guys are getting those, like, oh my gosh, all this time, it was X, Y, and Z. It was the one arm man, you know, kind of energy. Like, they're like, yeah, okay. Let's get it, you guys. So, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. All right. You have a deep knowing now. Okay. Yeah, it says fear is what's making you question the Capricorn energy. So, because it was, maybe it was about to happen for you guys. It's like, come on, for real? All right. Like, seriously? Like, it's not, it's going to be like, oh my gosh. I can't believe it. Whatever this is, is like something you've been wanting, okay? Whether this is a, comes to finances, whether this is love, whether this, whatever this is, okay? You've been like, I guess, I don't know. Like, God's been really like going back and forth or you've been going back and forth or somebody been going back and forth, child. Let me know what this is here. But I just seen Capricorn, Leo, and Scorpio could be significant here. And the Emperor, okay? Doing the right thing here. Becoming the emperor. Okay. Wow. You are a messenger. Speak your truth. Okay. Well, I mean, I am every day, emperor. So, you are a messenger here, emperor, or for an emperor to speak their truth. We got a Leo here. Somebody want to speak some sort of truth to a Leo here. The mirror effect. <gasps> Oh, okay, 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 okay. You are an emperor. I mean, you are an emperor. <laughs> we got the world card here. All right. So a cycle could be complete here. Yeah. A cycle may have been completed out. Speaking your truth, you could have spoke some truth to a Leo, about a Leo, and that ended some sort of cycle, sacrifices. 
All right. Oh, come on. All right. So, wow. Argue for your limitations and you get to keep them. Somebody argue for their limitations here. Yes. We got a uh, cycle is over. Virgo energy here. Yeah. Wow. And now you are unlike the truth. What? The will of fortune and the moon. Yeah, this is something you, this is shocking me right now as well, I'm sure as y'all too. So, a psycho is over. A psycho. Somebody could be fucking psycho. Maybe a cycle is over with some psychos. <laughs> okay. Listen, I got to get a message. I'm speaking the truth here, y'all. And, um, you are uh, unparalleled. So, you're unlike anybody else on this realm. We got a spiritual partnership here. All right. Whoever you are that's speaking your truth here. Okay. We got the Ace of Cups. So you're in a new cycle of love. All right. I feel like you got victory and success here over the Virgo energy. Okay. We did come out of that Virgo energy, of uh, that stuck energy. You don't have to be a person, but we were in that transit of Virgo. Okay. Like uh, you guys could be going through uh, leaving the matrix kind of energy. Um, and now you're going to have some sort of victory and success here. Are you over or you got victory and success over a Virgo as well? If somebody was trying to challenge you in whatever way this is. Oh, my fucking God. Why is this my birthday? OK, so your birthday could be October 18th. Truth. You could have got some truth on October 18th. We got the Wheel of Fortune and the moon with the truth card. You are the motherfucking truth tower. Okay, you spoke some sort of truth. Let me go look back on. Did I do any readings for October 18th? I'm trying to think. Did I do any readings for October 18th? I think I did. I'm not sure. But you spoke some sort of truth here. You are the truth and the light. You are unlike anybody else here. On this tank, on, this is the tower moment, happy home. Somebody could be having a tower moment right now, y'all. Or this is a shocking upheat. This is like an abrupt shift, an abrupt change here. Wish granted. Higher power is granting your wish. Happy, happy, maybe to have this happy home. This is going to happen all of a sudden. Treasure freaking island. Wow. Something significant about the 21st. But 21 breaks down to a three. The Holy Trinity. So you threes could be significant. You could be light path number three. Of course. Um, this is amazing, you guys. Oh, let's just read, okay? Let's get into it. <laughs> I'm excited. It's, it, do I know what today is? I mean, shit. Y'all let me know what today is. I mean, yeah, today is three. Celebration. All right. So you're going to be celebrating something today. All right. And why somebody is having anxiety about that? Because you won. You won. You are the victor over anyone that was trying to hold you back or keep you stuck or trapped in the old paradigm. People are looking at this person. Whoever this Virgo is, because I ain't never seen this in this card. But you see how this person looking at her? She looking at side eye like, hmm. I ain't, I ain't looking at her. <laughs> so somebody could be looking at a Virgo side eye right now like, hmm. I ain't heard that. I ain't seen that. Like, mm hmm. Like that kind of energy, y'all. Oh, my goodness. What is really going on here? It's weird. <laughs> Oh, come on. What is happening? You completed a cycle 
a psycho. Why do I keep saying psycho? Somebody's a fucking psycho. A Leo or a Virgo could be a psycho, y'all. Or they got that in a chart somewhere. <laughs> but the cycle is over, okay? You are, and somebody is seeing you as speaking the truth about something. You are the truth, the will of fortune and the moon. Your dreams stay okay. So what happened? Oh, yeah, today. Oh my gosh. So um, I had a dream that somebody was trying to make my path hard, right? And I, I was going somewhere and how it was like I was in like this maze or obstacle course or whatever. Everybody was going through this door, right? But somebody was trying to have me go through all these bends and turns and climb up and go. I was like, until I turn and look and seeing people just going through this door. I'm like, why the fuck would you tell me to go this way and people walking through the door? So I climbed my ass right on down and just walked through the door of my dance. Because <laughs> it was somebody at the door. This person that was at the door, he was, it was a guy in his light skin. He had like, uh, like red hair or some shit like that. Um... But he acted like he didn't want me to go through this door or he didn't want me to know that that door was available to me already. And it was so weird because it was like I was in like a water park or a cave or some fucking shit. OK. And um, it was like somebody was at this door. It was a brown skinned guy with braids. And I literally seen this person in the 3D on the same day. Like I'm. I don't know what that's about. Me seeing people in my dream state and then actually seeing them here is like, it's freaking me out. Because it's like, bro, and like, I don't even know you, bro. Why was you in my dream? Like, who the fuck are you? But in the dream state, he was like supposedly helping me do something. There was another guy with him and he was like, I don't know. It was weird. Okay. But make a long story short. Um... It, was, it wasn't it was no crazy dream. It wasn't no bad dream. None of that. But it was just like somebody tried to at the last minute. Like even though I was complete everything, they still tried to have me go through another obstacle course a whole nother way. And when I stopped because they were in another thing, they was so it was so much salt. Like so indication somebody salty as fuck right now. Okay. Because, like, somebody was trying to throw salt in the game or whatever this is. Somebody was trying to throw salt in something. And and he's sitting in the day. This is a salt water turtle, okay? So, somebody tried to throw salt in the game on some shit. Like, and I turn, I look. I'm like, what the fuck? It's a golden gate right there. Like, why am I about to go through all of this? I climb my ass right down, collective. I ain't gonna lie. And I walk right through that fucking gate. And everything was just available to me. Like, it was so many nice people. Um, on that side, wherever I was going, I don't know where the fuck I went, but it was cool. Right. Um, but somebody is salty because they thought that they was going to be able to get me to go in a whole nother direction, but I didn't. Right. So that just closed the cycle out for this person. And now they got the sad embrace. It's a bag man or bag lady. Cause she got a bag on her arm and shit. Eyes closed and shit. People looking at her sideways and shit. Like, mm, you know, somebody might wear head wraps or, um, I forgot the name of those things that, uh, the Islamic women wear over their face. So somebody could be, uh, Islamic or, um, yeah, I don't know, but yeah. Okay. It could be light skinned. Okay. Some of them. Okay. Somebody could be light skinned or brown, but either way, at the end of the day, um, that the cycle is over. I got triumph and success, success, victory and success here. So I'm in a cycle of the ace of cups. So the next cycle that you guys are going through is love. Okay. You are unlike anybody else. This could have something to do with a spiritual partnership here as well. All right. You are a messenger of truth. So you speaking your truth here. And that's why the site, the will is going in your favor. Okay, 1919, 19, as I said that, so that's 1010. 10. Okay, you could be a Libra. You do not have to be something significant about Libra season. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. Mm -hmm. You could have found out some truth in your dreams with that moon energy. That's where the cycle... Uh, the will changed or the will went in your favor here to have victory and success and triumph here because you learned some lessons here. 
So from earth to energy to fire. So that's fast movement. Earth energy is slow as fuck. Especially this Virgo energy. Slow as fuck. So something is about to happen very quickly here on this path here. Yeah, somebody tried to influence your path here. Okay, could be a Taurus or Aries here. Somebody was trying to influence something on your path. Yeah, and they fucked up. Five of Swords. They wanted to sabotage something. But they didn't or they messed up. They feel defeated now with the Five of Swords here. Because of the choices that you made. You made a different choice here in love. Maybe you're seeing something clearly about someone's. All right. Yeah, wow. Twin Flame and the Lovers. Wow. Wow. Yeah, this has been a long time coming. I feel like you. this was a long investment here or something was a long time. They just trying to control a twin flame connection. Somebody could have been, y'all. I don't know how deep this go for y'all. All right. Let's see here. Spirit, what's the message? What is the message? Wow. Eight of Swords. So somebody's all in their head that you did this by yourself. They feel powerless because you did this by yourself. Yeah, and you still, you got your wish fulfillment. Could be a Virgo or a Gemini, Pisces. But somebody is like, damn, like you did this shit all by yourself and you still made it through. Eight of Swords. This got somebody confused. Like, how the fuck did you do this by yourself? Maybe this takes several people to help them or they needed help or something. I don't know how deep this goes. Just let me know in the comments, y'all. Uh, how is this coming in here now? What is this spirit? Five of swords. Yeah, somebody feel defeated, y'all. Conflict, defeat. Yeah. The king of wands. They like, wow. Yeah, because they tried to cause some sort of deception here. Okay. Somebody could have been wearing a mask. Somebody tried to bind somebody. And you see this? This is like, she broke free of the bindage. All right. What is the obstacle now for said person? Six of Pentacles. So somebody definitely has an obstacle of having balance in their life or giving and receiving here. They are in regret that they lost. They may have tried to take something from you. Somebody tried to betray you here. They regret trying to take something from you as well. And the outcome. Somebody went on. How the hell? How did you know how to? How did you know how to do that? Or how did you know to do that? Whatever that was, you did something, and they like, how the fuck did you know to do that? Because that was hidden. That was a secret. Like, hmm. Or how did you know that that was going to balance something out for you? Like, what the fuck? Like, somebody just like, how? Outcome. Wow. We got the death card. Transformation. Endings. Wow. Two of Cups. Hierophant. So, big changes is happening right now. Hmm. Okay. So, we just Archangel Azrael is bringing in transformation endings. Raphael and um, Raguel. All right. Yeah, secret protection. Intuitive health. Somebody's trying to figure out how did you know you, your, your intuition? Something was protected for you. They were protecting you from something. Knowing something before it was too soon. That would have may have altered uh, your decision making moving forward is what I just heard. Wow. Hello, Divine Feminine. All right. Let's see here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Hello, Mother Gaia. So we got Gaia here, the environment, Mother Nature. So you're very connected to Mother Nature here. And here go that transformation. Transformer, 
transformation here okay violet flame and mercy of god here divine feminine so you have the mercy of the divine here damn another 10 18 so something strong about october 18th 19th and the 31st could be significant here okay um or the 10th the 19th and the 18th and the 31st could be significant it was it 31 days in December? i don't know um but we got purity of heart so your heart is very pure here so Lord Ganesh is removing any obstacles that somebody tried to put in your way here in, of your heart. When it comes to your manifestation, somebody tried to make you block your heart off here. Okay, it's been removed here. Archangel Metatron is bringing balance to all of your chakras. Okay, so you got your spiritual power has boosted here. All right, wisdom, crown chakra energy. On fleet, there we go. We got Jesus here. So this is like 16, 17, 18, 19. Like, so some, some, something has happened. Jesus came through. All right. To help you guys here. In whatever way. You do everything out of love, Divine Feminine. Strong Divine Feminine energy that's very connected to nature here. And here we are. It was written. You have opened your Akashic records. So you have the. Wow. And that, so the gate was gold. So this could have had something to do with your Akashic records here. Wisdom and time. Time is an illusion. We know that. Okay, so who invented time? Who invented... Who said that one minute was 60 seconds? Who said that an hour was 60 minutes? Hmm. Why is it only time here on this realm and nowhere else? Why does time exist here? And then look, damn, I ain't even peep. The clock bust open. There's no such thing. You may be realizing this. You broke that. Somebody breaking through the matrix here. Yep. Wow. And three. So three significant. So you could be life path number three. Archangel Gabriel could be very significant to you guys here. North Star energy. And she's holding a star. It's so funny. When I was growing up, I was in a group home called North Star. It's so strange. And the North Star has everything to do with your... Um, wow, spirit. Your North Star has everything to do with your North Node, which you are born and destined to do and be. Now it makes me think, like, was everybody in that group home specially gifted? And it, it, I'm sure it was because that's where I remember the first time anybody ever tried to do a spell on me, which was a Virgo. This is deep. So right now, you guys... There is it's, it's something is about to be connected. You're about to start connecting the dots here on who, what, where, when, and why, and how. From you figuring all of this out here, somebody got to release something to you, give you something here, and that's what makes them defeated, and they're stuck now. They don't know what to do. So, also, I'm getting that you guys been uh, being monitored throughout your whole <laughs> journey. As I said that, this card is, is sticking out here. I'm going to pull it. Wow. You've been being monitored the whole damn time. Sun and the stars. They've been watching you. And you made it. So, somebody, a Leo and a Virgo knows that you made it. 
Somebody knows that you made it. You made it through. So whatever control, like binding magic, anything um, restrictive or anything. Um, I'm hearing your wings. You get your wings. You get something here. So you're able like to manifest things at a rapid rate. And then also in that, in my dream state. Um, we was moving so fast. Like, uh, I noticed when, um, I move fast in the dream state, I always need to have water. And we was like, he was like, all right, let me go get you a water. And I woke up and I grabbed my water, went back in the same spot I left. So there is, um, something significant about water. Okay. Atlantis could be significant for you guys. I'm just I just heard our two worlds combined. Some your higher power, whoever this is here that has well, whoever this is, your angels and your spirit guides, God is very proud of you. They're happy. As fuck right now that you found Treasure Island and that's where I was. Like I said, wherever I was, it was like I they tried to make me go through like some old maze or something. But it was like, wait, something. I stopped myself and just turned and looked to my right, and there was a gate open and it was a bunch of water, and I walked through it. So by you guys uh, learning how to transmute negative energy into positive, staying in that childlike uh, energy has brought about a huge shift on this realm that time no longer matters for you. Wow. Wow. It's ending. Wow. Wow. Also, I'm hearing learning the truth about your birthday. What What is the truth about your birthday? Hmm. Was you really born on your birthday? Or was that that day you were assigned to a family? This is, this might, I don't know, y'all. <laughs> I want to stay surface, but I can't. Let me get an angel number here. All right. Your angels are hearing your prayers regarding your career and purpose and want you to know that they support your dreams. So go for it. Okay. Wow. Ooh. Your angels are encouraging you to connect with your tender aspect of yourself at this time, your vulnerability is a gift. Look. <laughs> that song, I feel like falling in love. That's a gift. So if you want to feel like falling in love, fall in love. <laughs> if you feel like falling in love, because that's what I just seen, falling in love. Go ahead. Yeah. Cause and effect. The cause and effect of you, of you, of you falling in love. Oh my gosh. Okay. It's really like that. Feel like falling in love? Fall in love. 
Let your hair down. Fuck it. <laughs> oh my gosh. You, cause whoever you are, you, we definitely are from the same, cause man, love is like, oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> and I've noticed um, that I feel like I got to keep myself like, uh, like I can't because everybody don't be wanting love like that or they don't, they don't, don't know love like. I know love. Like, you know how I... I know y'all be thinking like that, too. Like, it's like, oh, my gosh. Just to give love is... Oh, my gosh. It's amazing to me. And... Six of Pentacles is that giving energy. Like, who do you give it to, though? Right? Who... Who gonna be, like, okay with accepting all of this? Love energy. Like, that's where... Um, it get a little funny here on this realm because people don't know love. Like, like I'm a very oh my gosh, like oh my gosh, <laughs> and I know it's like when I give love, it's like it scares people. I know. Cause it's like, whoa, I never felt that before. Like you're so attentive. You're so nurturing. You're so caring. Like what the fuck? But that's what these people need. Y'all. I'm really like, oh my gosh. Right. And it feels great for an earth angel to give love. It's like, even if you don't give it at the magnitude that we do. Right. Right. We still feel so good to give it to you. If that makes sense. It's like our one of our passions, like to give the love. Like <laughs> y'all know what I'm saying, right? Anybody that dealt with a, a earth angel, yeah, because we hopeless romantics. I don't care. Very loving, nurturing. I just seen Queen of Pentacles, Page of Cups. Very loving, nurturing, hopeless romantic ass energy. Yes, we are. I don't care, right? But it's like I've noticed that if I like somebody, I'd be like, let me, let me back the fuck. I don't. This person, hey, that he might not, you know, like, and I don't want them to feel like, you know, you know. Let me just put it in my pocket, save it for later. Because it's so much. It's such in such a big magnitude that it may be overwhelming for a person that is not wanting that. You know? Hmm. But if you feel like falling in love right now, do it. Fuck it. Who cares? J your name. Eight of Swords. What's the Eight of Swords? Somebody feel powerless. Why? Why? Because, you, yeah, there's going to be a brand new start. Because you're having a brand new passion at the beginning. Somebody feel powerless here. And they mad that, they, that this player energies is going to be blocked here. So that's no more of uh, existence. So people that are players. So right now would be a good time, like I said. So, yeah, to ha fall in love or to give love here. All right. Like, I'm a really giving person. Like, yeah, man, uh, three of freaking cups. Celebrations here. All right. So I feel like this is karmic justice being served here for somebody that betrayed you in whatever way. Right. They thought they was going to get a one up here or something like that. What's the three of cups? That's over. Cycle is done. Yeah. Victory and success. Look at you. I feel like. Okay. I'm going to stop singing that song. <laughs> but Ace of Cups, Queen of Swords, Six of Wands, and the Will of Fortune again. Empress. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So reconciliation could be happening here. King of Cups, King of Swords here. Somebody could be shocked here or that 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 I don't know. Maybe they did a lot of work here together to maybe sabotage something here. What's the five of cups? Somebody feel defeated. I five of cups. Five of swords here. Somebody's been defeated. Yeah, the King of Wands has been defeated here. All right, you're going to have victory and success and love. Okay, could be a Leo here. What's the king of wands? Emperor. Oh, wow. Is in regret. They lost their empress. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. <laughs> <laughs> so, 
So there has been a loss here. Okay. Wow. They betrayed their empress. Oh, <gasps> you motherfucker. So if your person took some sort of action here to betray you, they lost, they lost you. We got the emperor here. Oh my goodness. They sorry for not putting the hard work and effort in or focusing on money. Now they're having a painful ending here due to the choices they made. They didn't choose love here. Or there is another lover coming to offer you love. Oh, wow. Spirit. Mm. Maybe they didn't accept your love. Your twin flame could have had the best love in the world, but they didn't accept it because it was like, whoa, this is too much. My mom never loved me and I can't. I don't know what to do with this. So somebody could have been dealing with childhood woundings they did not want to look at, did not want to do, no type of workings on. So they decided to make you stuck or feel stuck. All right. Or betray you in whatever way. Yep. But now it's like giving love. I told you give your love here. That's that's karmic justice for you here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I feel like somebody tried to take love from you or block your love or whatever. We got the King of Cups, King of Cups, King of Pentacles here. I feel like you could have gave a lot of love to the King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, whomever this is, or to somebody, or somebody is waiting for you to give, like, you can give me love, shit, I'll take that shit, like, I don't know what's wrong with the, somebody else, but <laughs> I want it, okay, what's the Ace of Cups? All right, maybe you tried to give love to this Taurus, this uh, person, what's the Ace of Cups here? Yeah, but they was a player player from the Hemmers. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, they was a player player. They was doing all types of shit. Being impulsive and lustful here. Yeah, you was trying to be in the union with this motherfucker. And they sacrificed you because they wanted to go play a uh, freeze tag with another hoe. So, listen. Well, they got what they wanted. Argue, argue for your limitations and you get to keep them. So this person argued for their limitations and they got to keep them. Now, the emperor's going to be falling in love with somebody else. Not them, though. <laughs> no longer is this your emperor. Okay, what's the Knight of Wands? Yes! <laughs> they did not. They could have ghosted you? Oh, that's fucked up. Yeah, there you are, empress. You wanted to bring harmony or reconcile with someone here, and it was a no-go. Yeah, you twin flame, but they was like, mm-mm-mm. Child, I feel like the... So, somebody about to be falling in love with your ass, okay? Mm-hmm. What's the death card here? So, something is over now. There's a complete ending of the illusion. Whatever this person was casting, or whatever this is over you here. Look at that, Empress. It's over. No more illusions, no more confusion, no other. You was the only option they fucking had. So I don't know what else they was looking for, sweetheart. What's this seven of cups here? <laughs> they had wishful thinking. It's over now, all right? What's the, that they could be with you as well? Seven of cups here, yeah, they lost you. Strong Scorpio, this is three Scorpio cards here, okay? You can have Scorpio in your chart or your masculine was a Scorpio. Man, they is salty balls, okay? Big salty, okay? Five of cups, they are in so much regret for betraying you. They regret betraying you. They had wishful thinking that there was somebody better than you as well, okay, collective? Yeah, look at that. They regret trying to manipulate something in secret as well. They regret doing magic on you in secret, trying to control you, hold you back here, child that only caused them all types of upheavals so whatever they was doing here they was trying to do magic on your intuition as well like maybe so you didn't see something here so you could walk away from this thing maybe so that you could think they walked away from a relationship as well child empress they listen it's over yeah they wanted something better than the empress I'll wait. I will wait for that. They wanted something better than the Empress. The Empress embodies all four queens plus the high priestess. Okay. And if she's spiritual as fuck, the higher fence. So I don't know what's happening. Yeah. But don't give up here because somebody was trying to call a stalemate, see a victory and success. But here go a love offer. All right. Somebody was challenging this person. All right. Or they feel challenged because you set self-sufficient, independent here and single and you're going to be falling in love with somebody else. This is a tough, 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 tough titty. Tough 
Titty said the kitty, but the milk's still good. Okay. Yeah. It's over higher fam. <clears throat> they wanted to change your spiritual beliefs as well. Yeah, somebody is consciously aware here as well. I'm hearing um somebody's belief belief what the fuck belief systems about uh your intuition here. Yeah. And how manifestations work. They are really in regret because something was only an illusion that they could bring endings to you or cause an ending. Could be a Scorpio or a Taurus here. We got Virgo, Sag, Strong Taurus, Aries, Leo. We got Aquarius, Pisces, not Pisces, um, Gemini, and Cancer. Somebody could have been working together here. Wait, Virgo, did I say Virgo? Yeah. Uh, somebody could be work was working together to try to close this these things out here. I feel like maybe they didn't believe in psychics. Now they do. And also, somebody intuitively know that this ending of these belief systems or something with spiritual wisdom. All right, they know you have a lot of that Venus energy here. Strong, yeah, that's Libra uh, energy and Taurus. So, Eight of Cups. What you believe it made somebody walk away from you, Empress. Archangel Gabriel, it says right here, wow. For three, yeah, as the Empress. So, Gabriel, of course, it's where it come through. Like, all of these is connecting the dots. If y'all did not see the reading I did with the Archangel Gabriel, make sure y'all check it out. Because he came, and I was like, what? And he gave me, remember I told you he gave me that big ass bag of money, and I am like, what the fuck is that? And the bull was naked. I was like, what the fuck is going on? And it was somebody in a yellow car, like, all this stuff is starting to make sense. <laughs> all right. But, yeah. Wow. So, we got a Latin man or a woman. O, C, Aries. A C, O, Taurus. They wanted to copy you here. They tried to put poison. So, this person might need to be careful of a C, O. All right. If somebody is incarcerated or something, they're going to try to poison this person. A Latin man or a woman. This is crazy. Somebody about to get karma here, Pisces. All right, so somebody's getting karma here. We got a Pisces karmic male. They know you wasn't from this planet. <clears throat> you made the right choice. Somebody is a narcissist. Yeah, they lied to you about everything. Q, Gemini. Emperor. Five years ago, sexually transmitted demons. A year ago. Somebody can't get over you at all. Somebody with big, big energy. Empath, but you know that. High priestess, you know that. Maybe you know somebody in a relationship, even though somebody could be trying to manipulate. All right. Something came to an end when it came to some sort of illusion. Seven of Cups. They are in regret for trying to even manipulate you when they knew you as a psychic. Okay, you already knew they was in a relationship. You already knew somebody was married. You already knew something. Somebody may have wanted you to fall in love with somebody that was already married or in a relationship. Okay, or something like that. Yeah, this is over. So they, somebody messed up bad. Yeah. A fire sign could be in love with you. We got new moon. Uh, people I trusted lied to me about you. 24 hours. 2022 is your year, so you got to be living it up, okay? Yeah, third party. You're never alone. <laughs> so third party could always, always, you always was in a third party relationships and shit. You was never alone with just you and one person. All right. Or people that was working together but on your behalf, Libra. Wow, divine bodyguard. Okay, definitely. We got T. I'm watching you in tears. 777. You're on the right path here to your success. We had Thursday here. Somebody felt like you were so hard to get in contact with a week ago. Somebody trying to get in contact with you last week. Maybe to tell you something. 
watch out for. That's what I'm hearing. Damn, Libra, you coming out heavy. Somebody only wanted you for money here. Yeah, that hex that curse is backfiring on them. What? Somebody magic backfiring, the hexes and curses is but everything is becoming undone right now. So it's like you did all of the right things by using your intuition here. All right. You're, so you can find out things, spiritual wisdom here. Wow. Somebody did not want to let you go. Somebody with a Toyota, Subaru, Cadillac, Mazda, whatever. Nissan, whatever. Okay. Camry. <laughs> yeah, Empress. We got a Sagittarius here. Okay. Child, people crazy. People crazy. Where, what is that message here? B, first last middle initial, Gemini, blue car. Uh, magic is backfiring times 10. Sheesh. Lots of backfiring of energies. Okay. And I'm seeing fireworks. That's how much backfiring shit is about to happen because these in the reverse. Belief systems, religious belief systems is no. It's no more. E. First last middle initial, yours and theirs. Their mind games are backfiring. Like everything is like backfiring. Bad. Somebody's just sitting there like, oh my gosh. Alright. Your love. Yeah, so I feel like falling in love. That energy. Your love is so fucking pure and it's so beautiful. I e I M E I number. I just heard that. So somebody was trying to get some sort of serial codes off of your phone or something like that. Um anyway, I don't know where that came from, but there it is. <laughs> okay, but now things are becoming more balanced in every area of your life here. Okay. And I was seeing like somebody definitely is sick at the fact that your love was so unlike any others. Unparalleled. You spoke your truth. You stood in your truth. You could even told somebody like, yeah, I'm your spiritual partner or we supposed to be together. However this is. <laughs> and they was like, yeah, okay. Yeah, so somebody, mom could be E or I or first, last, middle, initial. They don't like you. That was exposed on a full moon. Somebody can't stop missing you. Love always wins. The air sign is in love with you. M, first, last, middle, initial. This new person is scared of you. We got a Capricorn on Wednesday, F. Somebody got mental issues. Okay. Uh-huh. She big mad. Okay. The karmic is no longer in the way. It came in the reverse. All right. Can we just talk? Somebody ain't trying to hear shit. Somebody don't want to hear nothing. Oh, my God. This person got the say. Okay. It's your time to enjoy, Pisces. Okay. So, somebody was connected. Yeah, today. Somebody was connected to somebody that was toxic as fuck. And they like, you know what? Mm-mm. I feel so bad for what I've done. Yeah, because you was in the new love here. And somebody wanted this person to lose you for good. Mm -mm. It could have been somebody's ex that's stalking them, watching them. They wanted to fight you here. So I hope this helped y'all. Have a blessed day.